convince them that social or soft skills are very, very important if they want to enter the labor market. One of my students um, who participated as the fourth student, she's uh, just working on her master thesis and she's very focused on finding a job. So she knew already that social skills, uh, soft skills are very, very important for her. So she took the opportunity. That's the first meeting for the pilot group. And I think it was important to see the students and they saw us. We were two persons from the university as uh, mentors or all the instructions, how to use technically the systems and also in a pedagogical way, how, how we how we think it would be useful for them to use those. And I think this kind of face-to-face uh, -face meeting is important for students to be committed, or to become committed. I have four who finished the, the whole process, so this is the one I have more information with for. And she told me that uh, she just, she was like, at the end of the studies, she was a bit uh, confused. She had uh, like uh, knowledge and but she didn't know how to organize the knowledge. For example, what to do during a job interview. She had all the information, but she told me that she wanted to have more structure or more structured ideas on how to, how to behave during the interview, how to be successful during the interview. I was looking for uh, different skills uh, other people wouldn't have. On. Um, at the time, I didn't have, found, didn't have the real up uh, a real view of what I was looking for uh, and after when I saw the list I was like uh, I'm lacking in those ones and like for example uh, conflict management when I saw uh, soft skills in conflict management so I was like I need to take this one because I don't have anything any idea of how to resolve any conflict at the beginning there was no real um, field I was looking especially for and then I was like oh, I need this one and this one and uh, that's how I found out on the Elena for project there was like a whole bunch of uh, different skills I could uh, work on. The most important w was was high motivation uh, of these students who, who take part because in, uh, in our uh, students, uh, Polish students, they are more dis very disciplined and, and with high, um, um, high level of motivation. So one of the first advice is to include the learning process to improve the soft skills inside the curricula and to give a CTS for the finalization of the learning process. The second reason is probably that students have difficulties to choose their MOOCs, even the help of the guide of orientation. So, the second advice is to suggest some MOOCs already used by students and associated to soft skills, and maybe to add MOOCs in French. I'm generally interested in digital media, and especially in educational uh, digital media, and so I, um, yeah, it was an intrinsic uh, decision to, to participate. As I'm working in the multimedia Center of, of Multimedia and Higher Education, I'm very interested in MOOCs and in open educational resources and so it was a great opportunity for me to participate in this project.